Now we have a tangent over a sine. Um, we can always split up a tangent uh, expression into a sine over cosine expression to simplify everything. So right away, let's do limit as x goes to 0, sine of 4x over cosine of 4x all over sine of 3x. And if we look at this uh, expression here, we can split them up or simplify it into limit as x approaches 0 of sine of 4x over cosine of 4x times limit as x approaches 0, 1 over sine of 3x. And we can rewrite this again um, because this doesn't really help us in generating any special trig limit definitions to use. So let's rewrite it so that we can use some. Um, let's rewrite it as limit as x approaches 0, 1 over cosine of 4x times limit as x approaches 0, sine of 4x over sine of 3x. And we know that this uh, generates <clears throat> a 1 over cosine of 0, and this generates a 4 thirds. And 1 over cosine of 0 is just 1 over 1, which equals 1. So 1 times 4 over 3 equals 4 over 3, 4 thirds. And those are just some straightforward, direct applications of the special trig limits definitions, which you should know very well, uh, so you can apply them on the test to solve for the limits of any special trig limits. Thanks for watching educator.com. We will see you on the next section.